Hi, my name is Dr. Amit Agarwal, and I want to teach you how your body affects your mind and your emotions. Let's start with your intestines. Your digestive system has a stomach, small intestine, and large intestine. And your small intestine and large intestine have a nice lining, a protective barrier. Good bacteria in your intestines keep this barrier healthy. Over time, with antibiotic use, poor diet, stress, coffee, alcohol, and other chemicals, your good bacteria get killed off, meaning bad bacteria grow and create toxins in your intestines, which damage this protective lining. So you get gaps in this lining. That means toxins from your gut pour into your bloodstream and create inflammation throughout your body, which is the leading cause for asthma, eczema, arthritis, as well as anxiety and depression, and I'll tell you why. The inflammation in your body actually creates a demand for cortisol to be produced and high levels of cortisol or imbalanced levels of cortisol actually suppress feel-good hormones and neurotransmitters such as serotonin, dopamine and GABA as well as melatonin. The other thing I want to tell you about is your adrenal glands. Your adrenal glands are these little organs that sit above your kidneys and produce cortisol, adrenaline, and other hormones to help you feel good, respond to stress, and also balance your blood sugar levels. With chronic stress and chronic inflammation, your adrenal glands are pushed beyond their limits, and they go into adrenal fatigue, which most people are suffering from. With adrenal fatigue, what happens is your cortisol levels now become imbalanced negatively affecting your brain chemicals such as serotonin, GABA, dopamine and melatonin meaning adrenal fatigue is a major cause for anxiety, depression, insomnia and also it keeps you more vulnerable to small amounts of stress so if you have adrenal fatigue you'll often notice you might feel more tearful or overwhelmed easily by small amounts of stress the next organ I'd like to talk about is your liver. Your liver is the master organ of your body. It controls your digestion, your hormones, as well as detoxification. With chronic inflammation in your body, as well as all the toxins in the environment and in our foods, our liver has too much work to do and actually gets overburdened with toxins. If your liver produces less bile because it's overburdened with toxins, that means your body will be more prone to constipation because bile actually lubricates your stool to pass out easily. If you have more constipation, you are going to retain more toxins in your body, making chronic inflammation and chronic disease much worse. Also, with less bile being produced by your liver, you will digest your food less, which means there will be more damage in your intestines and you'll actually absorb less nutrients meaning that you won't have any good nutrients to make your powerful brain chemicals which make you feel good. So if you can heal your digestive system by eating the right foods, repairing your gut using probiotics and special amino acids, detoxifying your liver, minimizing coffee and alcohol as well as inflammatory foods such as wheat and dairy, and also taking herbs and supplements which restore your adrenal gland function you will notice that your energy will improve, your mood will improve, anxiety and depression will be much less, and you won't feel so overwhelmed easily by stress.